Britain and America stand ready to unite over a multi-trillion pound trading bonanza following Joe Biden's election victory. Boris Johnson said there was a good chance of striking a bumper trade deal as he hailed the president-elect's defeat of Donald Trump in the tightly contested vote. Britain and the USA have been in talks over a new trading alliance for more than a year with some experts predicting it could be worth a staggering £20 trillion. And a senior Biden ally today vowed that Brexit Britain will remain a significant ally of the US, insisting there is a lot of work to do together. Ahead of phoning Mr. Biden to congratulate him on his success, Mr. Johnson said significant progress had already been made on a transatlantic trade deal. I think that there is far more that unites the government of this country and government in Washington any time, any stage, than divides us, he said. I am a keen student of the United States trade policy and their tough negotiations. And I've never believed that this was going to be something that was going to be a complete pushover under any U.S. administration. I think there's a good chance we'll do something. Liz Truss and her team have made a huge amount of progress and well get on. And Mr. Johnson said that a significant chunk of any deal could boost the creation of hundreds of thousands of jobs in the green sector. I think now with President Biden in the White House in Washington, we have the real prospect of American global leadership in tackling climate change. I see that President Biden shares a slogan, Build Back Better. But when you come to build back better, one of the ways to do it is to do it through a green industrial revolution, green energy, green home building, green transport, EVs, all the rest of it. Those measures can not only reduce your CO2 emissions and enable us to get to net zero by 2050, but they're also capable of really moving the economy forward. So we look forward to talking about that issue with the White House. Britain has already struck a massive £15 billion trade agreement with Japan and similar deals are in the pipeline with Australia, New Zealand and Canada. Talks on future trading relationship with the EU continue with hopes a deal can be struck this month. Fears that Mr Johnson's relationship with the new president wouldn't be as warm as with his predecessor were dismissed yesterday by a key Biden ally. Senator Chris Coons, who has been tipped to become Mr. Biden's Secretary of State, insisted there were significant and enduring ties between the UK and the US. We've got more to do together than we could possibly do apart and I think those enduring and tectonic forces will bring us together fairly quickly, he told the BBC's Andrew Marr show. Asked if Brexit would make the UK a less useful ally to America, he said, that is not a view I share.